Hi everyone, I'm trying something different today. Since it's winter and my plants aren't really mm, growing as fast as they used to during the spring, summer, and fall, I decided to do a little introduction of my plants and just a short summary of how I got into plants and my plant journey as people in the plant community say. Just a quick disclaimer, I don't know if I should say, but I think I'll probably probably be doing more of these videos until winter is over. And I will be speaking both English and Korean depending on how I feel that day. So have a cup of coffee while watching this short video. The first plant I would like to introduce is this orange jasmine, and this is a picture of it in flower to do it more justice. The one next to it is a rosemint plant that I got from a friend that sort of introduced me to the world of plants. The next plant is sort of sad because it's actually one of the only ones that I bought and then killed. It is my eucalyptus plant and I don't know why it died. This is my date palm plant and next to it is my aloe which is also one of the five plants that I've ever bought in my whole entire life. The date palm I started from seed after eating a date palm fruit. This is, this is my ruby rubber tree and I will talk about it more later. And this is the first plant that I bought. It is a moonshine. And this is my plant setup. You can see all of my past experiments that are doing well. I usually give all of the past successful experiments as gifts to my friends and only keep one. This is a jade plant that I got from as a gift. Great aunt and you can see I am propagating a bunch of its leaves. And on the bottom I have sort of a nursery with two grow lights that I got just online and I don't think they're particularly strong so I actually just tied them up with bread ties. My rubber plant is actually the second plant that I bought in my life and now I'm trying to propagate it. I beheaded it. This is the top part that I'm trying to propagate and this is the bottom half. Through this video you can actually sort of get a sneak preview of all of my experiments. Thank you for watching this video.